What's up everybody? This is Willie. Welcome back to Three Pedal Devils. Hopefully you're excited for another Tao Tao video. I know some people are. I've got a lot of messages about it. It's been a while since we've made one, but we're back. You might have seen a previous video where we designed this uh, TBR7 Clevis replacement for the rear brakes. It's a whole kit. It's pretty cool. It's done pretty well. Helped out a lot of people get their bikes back on the road. And today we're back with another product, super simple one, but you couldn't find them anywhere before we got them machined and started selling them. But this is the stem nut for the Tao Tao TBR7. Billet machined, M24 by one thread, 30 millimeter hex, flange nut, it's got the washer integrated into it rather than the separated one from the stock nut. Here's the stock one that it replaces. Works just fine, it worked great for me, but there's been a lot of complaints from people of these loosening up and then they lose them or they just misplace them and then you can't ride your bike unless you're that one guy who messaged me saying you've just been keeping an eye on it. A little sketchy, bud. Message me, I'll give you a discount, $3 off so that you're not, what did he say? Just keeping an eye on keeping it. An eye on it. <laughs> I got my bike torn apart because I was test fitting the stem nut and then also checking my stem bearings to look at the part number and see what kind of torque specs we should be using. So that's why it's torn apart and today we're gonna put it back together and show you that the nut fits. Also, take a look at, bring a, take a look at this here, huh? TBR7 guys, what do, what do you think about this little USB mount I made here? Custom design, integrates pretty well with the Speedo. It's been working good for me. Easy to wire up. Drop a comment, let me know. If you think that design's cool or if you would want a USB on your bike, maybe I'll redesign it, make it a little better. Alrighty, wanted to do an update before I covered this up with my bracket here, but got the nut installed. Pretty easy. It's probably a short time lapse. Just threads right on. On mine, I just put it on dry because I want to test it out without anything special, but if you want to prevent yours from seizing in the future, you can always anti-seize underneath the flange, not the threads, just underneath the, the face of the nut. And then just a dab of blue Loctite on the threads, but I'm not too worried about it. So with mine, I'm just running dry. I torqued it to 55 foot-pounds. Huh. What's that? That's the next Tao Tao product, maybe? What's it for? This area on the bike right here. Okay, well, carry on. 55 foot-pounds is what I torqued it to with this good old westward. Thanks, Bo. And uh, yeah, now I'm gonna throw on this custom bracket I made. I think I made a video about that before the twat. I don't know if I ever posted it, but made this custom bracket so I could mount my phone and these lights and that ends up covering up my bars. So I wanted to show you the nut before I put that on. Alrighty, got her all bolted back together. This ram mount took a little bit because I could not find my ratcheting wrench, so I did it. My dog stepped on a bee. <laughs> like a peasant, manually. Oh, what's up? What's up? Took forever, but got her all back together. She is ready to rip. Where's the stem nut hiding? Down there. That's pretty much it. The soon to be luggage rack for Tao Tao TBR7s. Prototyping it right now. 
All right, guys, that's going to be the end of this one. Excited to make some more Tao Tao videos. Did not get around to making too many of them last season, maybe six or seven, because it got pretty busy when we started gearing up for the twat. But hopefully I can get a couple more in this season. It's been a while. We live in Wisconsin, so the weather sucks ass all the time. But hopefully it'll be warm enough soon where I can get this thing out ripping, get some drone shots, and start riding some fun trails. We've got a nice, nice? We've got a cool camping trip coming up pretty soon. So stay tuned. Catch you in the next one. Follow Matt on uh, YouTube or something. I mentioned our camping trip in my vlog. Oh, I know, but now I just mentioned it again. I know, that's cool.